time for the 11th. Back upstairs to Vance Cameron. Liz Finney, Casimir Luciano, Lux got a change, Winsun Rebel, Spectacular Future, Woodmere No Fool, Unstoppable Speed, C.L. LaRousse up front, the trailer, Timely Finance. It's the 11th at the top of the stretch. Approaching a start. There they go, they're up and pacing, Liz Finney leaving out, Lux got a change alongside, third into the turn, Casimir Luciano between horses, fourth, spectacular future coming three wide, unstoppable speed from fifth. Away six up the rail is Woodmere No Fool. Now seventh as they straighten to the back stretch. C.L. LaRue's. Then it's Timely Finesse and the trailer. Win Sun Rebel. Lux got a change made front. There's early company. Run alongside. That's unstoppable speed. And he'll go to the lead for Corey McPherson. 28 and two was the quarter. Lux got a change now second. Back into third is Liz Penny around the turn. There goes Casimir Luciano to the outside fourth. Racing fifth. That spectacular future. Now in six as they move towards that opening half mile. Woodmere no fool. See all the roofs on the outside seventh. Moving up eighth is Winson Rebel. Timely finesse on the rail ninth. Five in. Four out. And it's McPherson with unstoppable speed. The leader. The opening half mile up in 59 seconds flat. Lux got a change, getting a journey second. Stalling third is Casimir Luciano. There goes Spectacular Future. Three wide fourth. Out there three wide in fifth. C.L. LaRouche. Liz Tinney on the rail six. Woodmere no full seventh. Three high from eight. Wins on Rebel. Timely finesse trailing the field. They're by three quarters. Unstoppable speed. Turning it on here. He's opened up a five length advantage. Down to an eight left to go. Three quarters in one. 29 and four. And it's all unstoppable speed today. Lux got a change second. Up third spectacular future. Unstoppable speed all alone for McPherson. Up for second. That is spectacular future for Poulton. It might have been Woodmere no fool for the show prize in Arsenal. The mile in one. 59 and two. Okay, race number 11 under the wire here today for driving championship uh, continues on this Saturday. Unstoppable speed. And Bo, I was talking to Sterling, um, Kelsey Buchanan earlier. They're the ownership with the Mitchell and uh, David Tierney. You know, when you look at this guy, 13 for 26, uh, top three finishes, unstoppable speed. McPherson, they meant business here today. Yeah, well, he's a pretty classy old dude in his own right. And uh, you look last week, he made the jump to the optional fives. They were a little too much to handle. Drops back to the optional fours. And he was a lights-out winner here last time. He was second to start before that. But I got to admit, I didn't see this one coming. He made front, and he absolutely annihilates him for Corey McPherson. Does the training and the driving. We talked about the ability to train your own horses in this driver's competition and we've seen it a number of different times where that has played a big time factor into these races. It's McPherson and the ultra classy unstoppable speed here in race number 11. There's unstoppable speed going to the race 11 winner's circle. Pacing Brown Gelding, eight years, the son of Ben Bolio Hanover. Off the drop-off dam, J.K. drop-off. Owned by Dave and Mitch Turney, Sterling and Kelsey Buchanan, Corey McPherson training and driving. The miles in 159 and two-fifths. That's unstoppable speed in the 11th at trackside. Woodmere Farms has the presentation. <laughs> 